Well hello and welcome to the video. Hope you guys are well. Um, today I'm at a place called Summerlees Nature Reserve which is in Northamptonshire. You may recall uh, that I came here a few, when was it? Oh, must have been last year sometime. Um, and I was looking around to see if I could find anything of interest but I think that there was uh, a rat problem so I've been informed. So they weren't putting any feeders out and therefore there were no birds. But I'm reliably informed that this time there are an awful lot of birds around. Yeah, it's really nice. And if you're into your birds, it's fantastic. I mean, I just literally wandered along here, along these pathways. I had a little robin come and sit and pose for me, which I got a shot of. And there's, you know, already there's, um, I've seen uh, goldfinches and great tits and all sorts. So, yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting down the end. I've just been bumped into someone who told me that there's a male and female brambling here as well. So. I've never got a shot of one of those before, so that'd be quite interesting to see what they look like. Uh, but yes, it's lovely. It's just a really, a really, really nice place. Just turned up in one of the uh, hides that overlooks the water here um, and as is always the case really when I come here there's not an awful lot going on uh, but I'm making my way slowly down to the small bird hide that's what I'm really here for but uh, yeah uh, there's a few birds but they're all quite a long way away so there's not many shots to be had at the moment So one thing I will say about this place is it's really busy. I don't just mean busy with walkers, I mean busy with photographers. There's an awful lot of long lenses here. Yeah, very busy. But uh, yeah, it's good. It's a really cool place. So I can see why, to be honest with you. Uh, anyway, onwards. Doing, Afternoon, right? yeah, not too bad. Yourself? Yeah, good. Thank you. Gotta say, I really, I really do love it here. This is one of my favourite hides. Now you've got, well, you've got blue tits and great tits, and uh, lots of, lots of different birds trying these feeders over here on the, on the right-hand side. Chaffinches on the floor. Um, I assume that's where the brambling will be, somewhere down there on the floor. Um, hopefully, if it, if it shows up. But yeah, look, there's a, I don't know if you can see that, but there's a, there's a chuffinch just wandering about down there, which is quite good. And that's, I haven't even mentioned the bullfinches, you know, the male and female bullfinches, they're all over the place, which is really good. And they seem to like to come and land on this perch, um, along with the reed buntings as well, actually. Uh, you can get some quite nice shots, really, because you've got quite a nice diffused background there.
you can see that, but I've got a feeling in the tree over there, that's a red wing. I mean, it's, it's way too covered up to get any kind of a shot, but hopefully um, that'll pop out and we might be able to get something of that as well. But uh, yeah, it's not great at the moment. It's way too covered up. a red wing down there underneath the bushes I don't think he's going to come out but uh, yeah I think they're winter visitors I think they only come around sort of November to sort of I don't know late March time perhaps I'm not sure but he's not coming out is he just if I can get any shots of him under there just to show you Oh look and there's the there's the brambling just bodding around underneath that table. Yeah, I'm not sure. I think that's a female. I'm pretty sure the male's got a, a darker head. And I think I got one of those. A shot of that on the tree. So that might look quite nice as well, but where it is now it's a bit it's a bit tricky to get anything of it to be honest with you. A lovely place to come and visit here some of these it's uh as i said before we're in northamptonshire so if you're anywhere near local then it's well worth a visit it's uh four pounds to park for four hours i think it's six pound all day but i think it's well worth it well worth dropping a little bit of money into the into the trust to get them to hopefully upgrade the facilities i do hear there's a rumor that there may well be a visitor's center being built here before long anyway thanks so much for watching uh, I really hope you've enjoyed this one and uh, I'll see you next time.